Hi everyone and welcome. In this video, we will see how we can read data from our database and we can display those data in our node red dashboard in the table format. Okay, so here I have my SQLite database. You can see it is on my desktop test database and here I have my table Modbus data underscore one. I want to display some of the data of this table to my node red dashboard. I want to display the last 10 row of my database to my node red dashboard then how can we do it so here you can see i have this node red dashboard and if i click on the load report it will fetch the last 10 row of my database and it will display here you can see the 63 row number the value is 116 and 111.3 for tag 2 and tag 1 okay so if you want to do this then how can we do it okay so you can connect with any of your database it can be your sqlite database it can be your mysql database it can be your ms sql database the process is same okay once you click on the load report button it will load your report so if i change the value here like uh, one one two three point five and if i apply and if i write changes so you can see in the row number 63 for tag 1 we have a value of 123.5 and here 116 111.6 if i click on the load report you can see the value uh, whatever changes we have made in the database we are seeing that in the node red dashboard okay so this thing you want to make in the node red then how can you do this so here is our node red flow which i have created you can see the first node is load report button okay so you can see i haven't configured anything for this uh, node button node i just place this button node on the control section of the dashboard you can see the control section home tab and this button okay then after whenever anybody press this button or whenever you press this button it will send command to this function node what is inside the function node so inside the function node we have sql query you can see message dot topic in the message in the message dot topic we have sql query like select id timestamp tag one and tag two from morbus data underscore one table order it by local time which i have created here okay and uh, order it by local time and the descending order okay so it will read data from last row and limit it by 10 so it will only read the 10 data if you want to read the 20 data then you just have to change this one you have to press done you have to deploy the flow and you have to come back to the dashboard and you just have to press load report so it will load your 20 row from your database okay you can see here the last row is 44 and the 44 row is here 101.4 and 101.1 you can see the data here and here 101.4 and 101.1 okay so you can change your sql query from this function node it will pass the sql query to this database node so here is the database node you can see i have given the path of my database okay and i have provided the read write and create permission to the node red so node red can read the database write the database and create the database okay and it will fetch the data from uh, database when we pass the sql query from the uh, before function and whatever result uh, we will get from this database node we will pass that result to this table node inside the table node i haven't configured anything you can see i just place this table on the home report section you can see home tab report section and i have just change the size and that's it so whenever i press this load report button it will load my report okay it will read data from database and it will display it here if i just want only five row okay if i want only five row to display here and i can deploy it and you can see once i press on the load report it will only display the last five row if i want an ascending order then i can see i can change it to here asc limit 5 done deploy and you can see it will start from 1 to 5 okay and if i want a descending order then here you can see here you can change desc and then just press done and then deploy confirm deploy and it will be my last five rows okay so this is how you can uh, read data from your database okay it can be any database sqlite mysql 
anything and then you can uh, you know send your sql query to the database node and whatever result the database node will give you you can pass it to the table node to display those data in the node red dashboard in the table format okay so i hope this thing is clear and you can also add some more um, functionalities like you can add some uh, numeric node to select what number of row you want to limit okay you can add a uh, date picker node to get on for, for which date you want to load your report here okay so that is possible so all those things we will see in the future videos but this is the basic video that how you can you know read the data from your database okay and display it on the table in the node red dashboard so i hope this thing is clear and uh, if you still have any question confusion or any queries then you can ping me on whatsapp telegram instagram anywhere also you can comment on this video i'll happy to answer your question so we will meet you in the next video and in the next video we will see some upgraded version of this flow like we will use numeric node to you know get the number of lines we want we will use date picker node to pick a date for which we want to load the report in our dashboard okay so i hope everything is clear to you and uh, we will meet you in the next video till then take care goodbye and thank you